The system is called the Hossan system. It's a telemetry system. Um, obviously, a lot of land-based sports, team-based sports, use a lot of heart rates on the land. It's very easy to transmit data. Once you put that, that transceiver into water, you get a little bit of difficulty with the water blocking the signal. So this Hossan system is designed to have a bit of a stronger transceiver, um, which is placed in, in the swimmer's backpack to kind of uh, increase the signal of the heart rate belt to my computer. And we can have up to 32 swimmers at once showing on a computer screen. I mean, this gives you great instant feedback of just what their body's going through, basically. Yeah, it's really useful for lots of different things like steady sets to make sure they're going steady and recovering in the right way uh, looking at threshold to MVO2 sets are working 30 beats below max and having it in kind of a colour scheme instead of just looking at numbers all the time so everybody's got different max heart rates especially in para swimming we've got a lot of shapes and sizes that we have to cater for so everybody's heart rate zone is tailored to their own own specific makeup um, but everybody will have the same zone with the same emphasis on it. So instead of just working with numbers, we can work with colours, which is a lot, lot better to understand. So threshold MVO2 sets are really easy to use it. And also looking at something as basic as warm-ups as well and exactly what the content of that warm-up contains. Just how much of an advancement is it to have this for swimming? Because obviously with the water, it's, it's brought problems. Yeah. Um, it's just instant feedback. Um, in the past, uh, heart rate systems have been at the end of the pool so when the swimmer finishes the length they'll take a heart rate sponge or a heart rate belt and, and put it on them but um, with athletes like this in the first 10 seconds your heart rate can drop by 10 beats so you're getting quite an in inaccurate measure of the heart mm. rate it's kind of a guesstimate um, this is an instant data receiver it, it takes um, three seconds from the transmitter to my screen so you, you're basically getting a very instant image but also duration of the swimming as well. It's not just when they stop, it's when they're actually swimming, so it can give an indication of pacing as well.